Good morning, yarn tubers. Welcome back to Dana's Wonderlust Crochet with Dana and Dooley. Dooley, Dooley. Here he is. Wait a minute, where are you? Hi! Hi! You're so cute. He's waiting for me to get uh, dressed. And I decided um, since I don't have a trailer on um, while I'm waiting for this load to get um, ready here in Ogden, that I would, you know, treat myself to a janky little hotel room. Look at this. Look at this lime green wall. I mean, can you believe that? <laughs> That's amazing. So anyway, Ogden, Utah, and, um, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> as some of you know, Laura from Mad Mimi Crochet and I have a little um, competition, friendly competition going on uh, to see who gets the Phoenix blanket done. And she's, you know, she's like a stitch ahead of me or so. She's getting her rear end handed to her because I just finished round 53. Yay! This is such a fun pattern from the Hooked on Sunshine website. Um, I mean, it's just, look at this. This work, I, she is like, the, the designer, Vanessa from Hooked on Sunshine, she's like a crochet ninja. It's amazing. Uh, so, and honestly, this little friendly thing going on with, um, Laura and I texting each other, you know, get round 53 down, you know, we're having, we're having a good time. Not only does it make it more fun, but it's helping me, you know, not take as long with the Phoenix as I did the art of blanket. Um, because I have, I mean, I'm, I'm sitting there this morning talking to Mama Swift and Carrie the Yarny Elephant. Um, you know, I've got these colors going through my head about this, this leaf square I, that I showed you guys in one of my recent lives, um, doing that square and the colors are going through my head as to um, what it's going to look like. And I'm getting so excited about it that I'm, I, even though I'm just super enjoying every round of this Phoenix, that uh, I, I'm just, I'm ready to move on. You know, I have that to do. And then I got to finish the granny square blanket for the, um, for assignment number three of the crochet skills development course. I want to get that done. And then I'm going to go on to the leaf motif uh, blanket bedspread. So I'm very excited about that. Uh, I think I'm, you know, one. I'm going to do like, Two different colors of the squares. Um, one square will be this. Um, it's like a what do I call it? Like a like a dusty purple color, and then in kind of the same fashion, I'm going to do uh, the other square. You know, half the squares in that color, and half the squares in like a I wouldn't say an olive green, but a green that kind of you know is in the same hues as this like dusty purple so alternate those colors and then um join them with this um buttery cream color right here uh mama swift is helping me um you know as i'm brainstorming while i'm crocheting and talking to her and carrie um oh, i'm so excited i want to start it right now but i'm going to finish the phoenix that baby is due at the end of uh, October. So 53 rounds done. I'm almost halfway done with the Phoenix and hopefully I'll be done with it <laughs> in the next couple weeks. <laughs> well, I'm certainly going to be done with it before Laura is. Just so you know, girl, <laughs> we're having a lot of fun. So that's what's gonna, um, that's what's going on now. So you got to see a little update. You got to see my my green wall isn't that beautiful got to see my puppy got to see my puppy he, he's like are we ready to go trucking yet yeah i gotta call on my load and see if it's ready yet so anyway that's just a quick update i don't have anything else it's the phoenix the granny squares done in the 
a true traditional granny square done in the you know the way granny squares used to be done and um and that blanket you know and then i'm doing do the leaf motif uh bedspread but that granny square blanket when i get done with that um assignment number three of you know with those with that blanket i'm going to ship that blanket off to rosalie at yarn it out because um you know she's asked for blankets to be donated because she donates them to her local VA and she donates a lot of things to them. But, um, and she doesn't get a lot of response, I don't think. So, you know, it'd be nice if, you know, those of you who do charity projects, who like to whip up a little lap gan, um, you might consider sending one to Rosalie. Just a thought. So here I am getting excited. And then after that, I got to do my Aunt Martha's blanket, which is a, like a rose garden granny square kind of blanket, a one-sided granny square. Um, but I'll, I'll follow the pattern because she likes it so much in the book that I bought. So anyway, um, shout out to my nephews, Cole and Lincoln. I love you boys. Love you boys. Mwah. Okay, you guys all be good today. Try not to get in a big crochet rivalry. <laughs> She's going down. Crochet wars. Snitches get stitches. I love you guys. Bye. So just as an added bonus, I want to show you guys my new stitch. You've got V-stitches, you know, boring old V-stitches. And then you have my new stitch, the one-legged V-stitch. We're going to be famous, Dooley.